What's up everyone, my name is Jesse and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to change the oil and filter on a Dodge Charger with a 3.6 liter V6 engine. Regular oil changes are crucial for keeping your engine running smoothly and extending the life of your car. So let's get started. First, loosen the oil filter cap with a 24mm socket and a half inch drive ratchet. It's recommended to remove the oil filter cap first to allow the old oil from the filter to drain down the sump. Carefully pull the old filter from the plastic cap and remove the old rubber o-ring gasket. Lubricate the new o-ring gasket with some oil and install it on the filter cap. Spin the filter cap clockwise by hand and torque it down to 25 newton meters or 18 foot pounds. You can also tighten it by hand, just be very careful not to over tighten it, it can crack the plastic and then oil will leak from it. Next, we need to safety lift the car. Engage the emergency parking brake. Use your floor jack to lift the front end of the vehicle and support it on jack stands. Place a 2x4 on the floor jack to protect the frame. There should be a plastic cover underneath the car, a skid plate, but it's missing on this vehicle. You have to remove a few 10mm screws to gain access to the oil pan. Locate the oil drain plug and loosen it with a 13mm socket. Let the oil drain completely into the catch pan. Once the oil has finished draining, inspect the drain plug washer gasket and replace it if necessary. Depending on the material of the washer, some can be reused. Tighten the drain plug securely and torque it down to 20 foot pounds or until it's nice and snug. Again, avoid over tightening it, you don't want to damage the aluminum threads. With the old oil drain and the new filter in place, it's time to add some fresh new motor oil. Locate the oil filter cap on top of the engine and remove it. Using a funnel, pour in 6 quarts of 5W20 motor oil. The brand and type is your preference. To reset the change oil message, follow these steps. Without stepping on the brake pedal, Turn the ignition switch to the on run position. Do not start the car. Then fully press down on the gas pedal three times in 10 seconds. And that's it, you're all done. You have successfully changed the oil and filter on your Dodge Charger. If you guys found this video helpful, hit the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one. Late.